Japanese tech firm Nintendo have soared in the last week thanks to the launch of its new mobile game Pokemon Go, which has become a worldwide sensation. Players walk around real-life neighborhoods to find virtual cartoon or Pokemon characters on their smartphones. But there are concerns about how safe it is, as Joe Tidy reports. Something strange is happening in towns and cities across the country. You're not playing Pokemon Go by any chance, are you? I am. You are? Yeah. <laughs> it's been described as a cultural phenomenon. It's pretty decent, like everyone seems to be doing it. Wherever you look, grown men and women are using their phones to find cartoon creatures. <laughs> We've come to a park here in London to find out just how many people are playing. The telltale sign is people wandering around like this. Excuse me, mate. Hi, mate. You playing Pokemon Go by any chance? You are? Yeah. <laughs> I thought you might be. Are you playing Pokemon Go? Yeah. Are you playing Pokemon Go? No, sorry. Oh, OK. Are you playing Pokemon Go? Yeah. Hey, are you playing Pokemon Go? Yeah, I am, <laughs> I knew you were. <laughs> Pokemon Go is the first major augmented reality game. It mixes real-world maps with superimposed monsters. Players have to explore around them to catch them all using GPS. It's that idea, it's the same kind of uh, principle as, as Tamagotchi back in the day, where you, know, you, had, you were collecting monsters and they were yours and then you could go out and do battle with them. It's, it's that idea, it's very addictive for people. It will go on to make a lot of money and the early signs from investors are that they're very confident in uh, Nintendo's ability to monetize from this game. With so many people engrossed in their phones, there are reports of accidents. And it's not just road safety that's got people concerned. Although the game's designed to only be played in public places, we've had situations today where we've followed Pokemon down private roads, and in America, there have been some complaints from cemeteries where players have congregated, and even in one case, a Holocaust memorial museum. The company says safety is important. This message comes up every time you launch the game. Getting absolutely slaughtered. <laughs> no previous app has ever caused this much hysteria. But there's every chance this creature catcher could end up being a short-term craze. Yeah, so back to the office. Back to the office. All right. Nice Great. to meet you. Thank you very much. Thanks, Have a good day. Cheers. Cheers. Good luck. Thank you. Joe Tidy, Sky News. Time now for our technology show.